Uh, so let's begin. It's uh, 5 07. Uh, welcome to the virtual public meeting of the Arlington Housing Authority for a special board meeting, uh, Wednesday, February 2nd. And as I said, it's 5 07. So we'll do a roll call. Um, Brian is here. Nick? Yes. Gar? Here. And Joanne? Yep, here. Urella uh, has notified us that she's unable to join us. So we have a quorum. Um, first thing in the agenda is approval of the capital improvement plan budget revisions. Uh, a, the electrical upgrade at the Chestnut Manor. Jack, you want to talk? And the second is the common air flooring replacement at Drake Village. So Jack? So just to give it a little bit of um, background for the uh, electrical upgrade at Chestnut Manor, um, as part of the, the, the work that the insurance company is going to be doing there related to the fire for those 20, um, 20 or 18 affected units, um, they're going to be upgrading electrical, you know, panels and things like that. So in order to take advantage of, of this opportunity there, we're going to try to get DHC to help us pay for um, upgrading the electrical panels and other systems in the building at the same time. Um, we think it's a great, great measure. We'll get rid of um, the existing uh, electrical panels, uh, which are dated and, you know, it will be a great opportunity to hopefully tap into this state funding. Um, to help pay for it as well instead of our typical normal uh, formula funding. So I'm I'm confident that um, the state's going to be supportive of this. Um, right now, based off the capital planning systems assessment, it looks like it'll be about a four hundred nine thousand dollar project. Um, and but you know obviously the full scope of the project is not going to be included in this because eighteen of those units are going to be covered through the insurance. So it's probably going to be you know lower than this or however much lower than this. Mm -hmm. And then, Is that, and then oh, go, go ahead. I, I wasn't sure if you wanted me to move on to the next, probably um, just wait for this one, right? Yeah, so um, in terms of a vote, um, a simple motion to uh, adjust the plan to uh, for the upgrade electrical upgrade at Chestnut Manor, or is there a number we ought to put with that or what? I didn't see it in the agenda thing. It's the, the number is not on the agenda, but it is on the um, it's in the capital planning system and the, in the board okay. packet. And I mean, it's it's um, that's a very broad assessment. So I'm not, you know, I'm going to use uh, the capital planning systems number um, right. for my revision, but we'll see what the actual revision ends up being after DHC okay. takes into account the insurance company. I see it. So it's pages one and two in, that in your attachment there. So I guess we need a motion to um, amend the budget accordingly uh, for the ability to upgrade the electrical service at Chestnut Manor. So moved. Second by Gar, but I think you're on mute, Gar. I'll second. Okay, so moved by Nick, second. Um, before we vote, uh, is Sandy on here taking notes, Jack, or are you taking notes? I'm gonna take notes, yeah. You're recording it, okay. Yep. So the motion's moved by Nick, second by Gar. All in favor, uh, Joanne? Yes. Nick? Yes. Car? Yes. Yes. So we move on to number B, common air flooring replacement at Drake. So just to give some insight on this, since I'm already doing a budget revision, I thought it was a good time to consider some other needs within the portfolio. And some one minor need, which we'll, we'll have money for in our formula funding, um, is a, uh, um, a common area flooring replacement at the cottages in Drake Village. One of our property managers down there did um, did a walkthrough recently and noticed that some of the, the carpeting was starting to bunch up. Um, she was able to identify the hazard, and I feel you know, given the opportunity to address it right now with this other budget revision, it's it's timely, and you know, we'll be able to um, to use this funding to do it instead of our regular operating budget. Okay, sounds simple. Do we have a motion to approve? Hold it. Hold it. Oh, the, the cottages have a common area. It's, yes. uh, it's just that small walk-in area. You know, you open up that that door and then there's the stairwell that goes upstairs to the second cottage. There's yeah. some carpeting and then the- um, In all of them? In all of them. So it would be 18 total, hopefully, um, that we'll be able to do. But, at, but we would at least prioritize the ones that, you know, the carpeting is starting to bunch up. Can I ask you a question? Yep, Dom. So it looks like it's gonna cost 26,000. Is that right, right around? That's, I'm looking at it right? Yeah, so that and that's that's based off the capital planning systems assessment. 
okay. um, which I which I utilize. I just utilize the old components and the cost to replace those components. Um, so that's that's what it's giving me as a price, and and you know hopefully, you know we'll be able to to do all of them, but at least able yeah. to. Do, but we will be able to uh, at least do the ones that need it. Okay, and then my next question is, um, well, how come we don't use those carpet squares that can be replaced if like one gets soiled? You just mm. Instead of, instead, of, instead of it says roll goods. Yeah, and, and these carpets, the ones that are being replaced, they're, they're original with the building. So okay. they're from like 1961 or whatever. Um, yep. so it's, uh, oh, wow. So it's, it's, so it's just, they're, yeah, they're, 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 they're very- so, they're so they might use the carpet squares, commercial. Exactly, yeah. Okay. Exactly. Do we have to put the carpet down there? I'll say that again, Nick. Do we have to put the carpet? Or does that make sense? No, I mean we're gonna we're gonna uh, talk to the vendors and, and determine what's the best product to use. Okay. So do we have a motion to accept that? So moved. Second. Gar will second. So uh, motion to approve the flooring replacement at Drake is moved by second by Gar. All in favor, Joanne. Yes. Nick. Yes. Gar. Yes. Brian is a yes. We move to number four, approval of the proposed change order requests. And so um, change That's orders right. one and two um, are relative to some additional abatement that needs to happen. Um, just, it was unforeseen, you know, that they would have to, to do some, some additional plumbing in different areas and some additional work related to, um, that's gonna require some additional abatement. And then the uh, change order three, um, it's it, it's yeah, it's a good opportunity for us to replace the frozen gate valves um, at the Chestnut Manor bat in that area. So um, we determined that you know it, it was worthwhile for us to to address this uh, as part of this project. So we we expanded that as part of the, uh, the project scope. So I think we need three separate motions: one for A, one for B, and one for C. Correct. Jack, three separate motions. John, do you think we need three separate motions for this? Um, as long as you can show them clearly that in one motion, you're okay. Otherwise, do three mm -hmm. separate motions. If you can show uh, change order number one and a vote on that, change order number two, num you know, et cetera, and then go down three and four, then that's okay. Uh, but you'd have to show that there's a vote on all four. And, and, and if somebody didn't li like two, but okay on three, then mm -hmm. you definitely have to do three separate, four separate ones. Okay. All right. Yeah. So, so we have three. We have three motions A, B, and C. So, does somebody want to make a motion? Yeah, I move to uh, approve change or PCO dash zero zero one in the amount of eight hundred fifty seven dollars and forty three cents. I second it. Okay. So we A is moved by Gar, second by Joanne. Uh, all in favor, Joanne? Yes. Gar. Yes. Nick. Yes. Brian is yes. Uh, so we move on B. We motion for B. Yeah, I will move to ch approve change order number two in the amount of 3,375.45. We have a second. Second by Nick. So uh, B is moved by Gar, second by Nick. All in favor, Joanne? Yes. Nick, uh, Gar? Yes. Nick? Yes. Brian is yes. Uh, number C. I'll do that one too. <laughs> I, I'll, I move to uh, approve change order number three in the amount of 1,513.26. <laughs> sure. By, second. Yeah. <laughs> second by Nick. So uh, number C is moved by Guy, second by Nick. All in favor, Joanne? Yes. Agar? Yes. Nick? Yes. Brian is a yes. So we have no other motions. And, and just for the record, we have no other participants on this call. Right, Jack? Uh, there's three participants. Three. <coughs> Sorry on this one. OK. Sorry about that. I see it now. Um, OK. Um, so we have a motion to adjourn. I move to adjourn. Jack. Jack. 
Yes. You have to stay and talk to me about the herd field and what you've been doing with the people who are going to change it, right? Because I have to vote. I have to comment on it. I'll, and, I'll give I'll give you a call right after this, Joanne. Oh, you're not going to stay on? Okay. Yeah. Do it no, in the we've got every, There are other participants on the call, so we'll have to shut the call down. So we have a motion to adjourn by Nick, second by... Second. Uh, all in favor of adjourn, Joanne? Yes. John? Yes. Nick? Yes. Brian is a yes. So thank you for making the time and meeting is adjourned. Thank you. Thank, thank you, guys. guys. Yeah, have a good night. That was fast. Thank you.